but I made it super complicated for myself for no reason. Okay, next part. Let's figure this out. This, what's this? That wasn't so bad. Kinda of frustrating, but not so bad. Like I was looking at this guy. This guy didn't even know how to do it. This guy did not even know. Like he was making. He did. He did it right. But like he was just so. He kept going back and forth, back and forth, and like he kept like going the lever and going the wrong way. Like I don't know. But I didn't even follow his guide. I just looked at it and I was like, "This isn't gonna help me." And I just figured it on my own. <laughs> Okay. Uh. Rock something food. Blisters? Okay. Um. This way. That looks like a place where you would perform rituals. Well, at least I can recognize some signs we've seen in the temple. Oh, that's what we're standing on. Looks like like there are some food grains on it. Some of the signs under the pedestal look familiar. I think they're okay. Um, oh, this looks crazy. What are we doing here? Rock.
<laughs> What's going on? Oh. Greetings! It has been a very long time since I've been formally invited into this world. Thank you for your sacrificial objects. I especially like the edible objects you brought this to me this time. In return for your nogurt, I shall bring you unist to the ones you have lost. Oh. Now I shall return to the Kratorium and continue building a world for my fulfilled inhabitants. I thank you for your contribution. May our world connect in peace one day. Farewell! Whoa. That was terrifying. Huge mud stream devouring our entire city. Oh, how may you be? You look different. I'm a woman. Hey cat, this game is so cute. You are not blink like us. Do you know a city is still intact? Do you know if the city is still intact? Um, sort of. Structures probably built by blinking blink. Imagine they are indestructible. You people live there now. No, the Frickners live there now. Frankeners? Frankener does not know of Frankener. Must be future people too. Does anyone else live in the city? Giant face. <laughs> Pretty much. The bank rent? Of course! They can ask him what to do. Blink rent always says that he know what is best for Blink. Can in. Dude, this, these fucking words are hard. These nouns. Blink, remember we were off eating the blanket mud? Does Blink suggest that bank rent has something to do with mud stream? Think it, we fed him endlessly, but the Blink rent always wanted more. He must have gotten too much at this at some point. Blink is right. Blink rent wiped out our entire civilization. Blink is worried it is going to happen again. Now Blink know that Blink rent, bank rent is still alive. We must pre prevent feeding Bankrate at all costs or else the entire world will be crushed by mu massive mushroom again. Blink has to talk to Blink Blankrant. Maybe we can sort some sort things out in private conversation. What about the Frankners? The place is filled with Frankners. What about them? They can be very aggressive. That is not good. Blink wants a conversation with just the three of us and Pinkrit. We must lure Frankner somewhere else. Does Wom have an idea how to do that? Maybe with food. Yeah, food. Maybe Frankners can be lured with food? I'll try to think of something. Oh, before Blink forgets, Blink has something that might help you. Oh. Blink can use medallions to activate things. This instrument can produce different notes. With the right combination, one can activate Blink Link technology. One can change tone using WASD. Note combinations are usually displayed on the device. One should be able to open doors in this room. It can produce five different notes with the right combination. One can activate Blink Link. It. What you assume? <laughs> Won't take it. Now let's find a way to lure those freaknings away from the bank rent.
All right, tango to the surface. Wonder. <laughs> They're just okay. Um, I need this dude. He won't attack me. Hey, these are different now. Okay. So there's something going on. They came in here. They're gonna like rob the food place or something. These group of Mekners. Maybe there's something to do with that. Oh, I hear it. Um. Oh. over here though no ship in a safe spot nice If I use one of these guys No? But you? No? Hmm. Puzzles! What do I do?
You just pull it. What I was doing. Hmm. Looks broken though. How do you... Can you help? I figured it out. I'm smart. Oh. Okay. It's the only way. <laughs> it was the only way. I don't want to do it.
Oh no! I see, I see. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. That didn't work. It's okay. Why is he doing this? Oh, it's just Rambarf Zdenzeep. This is the name I gave myself. <laughs> Rambarf Zdenzeep. I almost thought we got busted. Oh, these are the people that are plotting the heist. Nah, we got out of there unnoticed. How are you doing, Rambath? Just passing through, doing good. Passing through, you know. Alright, see you around. Wait, uh oh. Something smells strange. What is it, Pilvin? A worm! Oh, they found out. Why am I lagging? Hey, huh? Who closed the store? 
Or should we look for Chef Fokui? I want to eat. I guess we could wait around for the food drop. We could always start with the onion you found. Good idea! Let's go eat in the food drop. Yeah, yeah, I transformed back just in time. We'll save. That was rough. Damn it. Okay, it's fine. That was crazy, man. Yeah, leave. So we go. I know any better. I think this drops me all the way down, so I don't want to do that. There's a whole womb city, dude. Like, it's an actual, like, like, legit city with lots of stuff in it. Lots of people. Crazy amount of people. Almost. Ah, ouch! How do you do that? Oh well, I guess I'm loose, I'm loose now. I got ambushed by a group of Frankers. They tried me up. I think they want to replace me or eat all the soup themselves. I wanted to try out a new recipe, so I guess I took it a bit longer than usual. Maybe they got too hungry. I'm very far behind on my schedule now. You want to help me out? Yeah, sure, man. Great. Give me an onion, a rock, and a football trophy. Once you got them, throw them back into the basket at the end of the, the room. This Frankner seems to not care what we... But this Frankner seems to not care we not Frankners. I think I have an idea. Let's uh, we let this freakner finish soup, then we throw soup out the tower. Our freakners will have a food party where soup falls down, so Bakner and Wum talk to Binkrit without being attacked. That sounds nice, dude. Oh, bad, this basket. Okay, so we have... We have everything? Leaf. Right now we have... Rock. We have... Trophy. Need the onion. Where do we get onion? Mm. Give me an onion, a rocket in front of it. Once you got them in the room. Well, I guess I gotta figure out what an onion is. <laughs> okay, that's convenient. Oh, I thought this was a rock, so I can not like... Never mind. Can I leave? Why not? Hmm, it smells like food here. It smells great here. It kind of smells like black, but it's making me hungry. What's this? You know what I did. Alright, what would I get? Pure blank. Rotting blank. Wow. A mixture of something terrible and something delicious. Hey, you. Are you 
hearing a vip leaf by any chance? Damn. Nice. I know this is a lot to ask, but could you give me it give it to me? Sure. Awesome. Throw it on me then. Oh, you're a woman? That's unexpected. I should attack you now, but gave me food. Fog. Can't decide. I was raised to hate ones, but love food. Whatever. Gave me food, so you're on my special VIP list now. You can enter my special VIP door whenever you like. Yeah. Right, I'll take it. Okay, I need a onion. Over here. Okay, wait, let me try that again. I think I know. I stopped moving right. But. I think if I try that again. Get a lot farther. Maybe this guy sounds audience. Let's see. Light bulb. No onions. Okay. Can't use that VIP door yet. How'd they get up there? First place. Oh, I know how I got up there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was this way. Let's we'll save up here, right? Yep, remember. How do I get that? Oh, I don't stress too much about it. So there was nothing here. play fun? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh. Not really. I find the union. Maybe.
Oh, I guess I got the uni now. Alright, turn it back up. Wait, is that the onion? Just make sure. It looks like it though. Onion! Prehistoric fruit. Ooh. Oh no, I'm gonna die. No, I don't wanna do this again. Wait, I could just leave it come back. Alright, we got the onion, we got the rock, we got the first place trophy. Nice, that'll make the soup so much better. Looks like you collected all the ingredients. This saves me a lot of time. <laughs> By the way, did any ever tell you that you look super ugly, even for a woman? <gasps> but your smell is kind of interesting. Might be just a touch of that my new soup needs. <gasps> hmm, such a peculiar smell. Yes. Yes! It's perfect! It'd be the secret ingredient! Aren't you lucky? Wait, I'm, I'm dying. I'm dying. I'm dying. Okay, this is gonna be a hard one.
Huh. Oh, I got stuck in my health. I can eat something. Okay, I know how to do this now. I know the way. <laughs> he just picks me up. That's funny. I kind of botched that one. to dodge those. Oh, those things kill me. Those things don't. Maybe did it. Okay. <laughs> One is good fighter. Frickers so you mean. We can push this soup pot out of this building. Frickers will come to eat. Then we can talk Frank Grit in private. Think remembers this room. Think used this room to push out ugly rocks. Then we crushed them outside. The room has a machine that pushes big rocks out. We can activate together with the right melody. Does that work? The machines can damage tower too much if used wrong, wrong time. It is a safety procedure. We think it need to make unanimous decision to activate. We need to activate together. Um, one, follow, one, follow our lead with instrument. Uh, oops. The faces. We had to make a cons constant note. But
It's gonna take forever. Ah, oh, fuck. Okay, so right, right up. Fuck. Oh, I can't know how to kind of do it better now. Ah, oh, fuck. Ah! Hey, okay, I did it. I figured it out. Did it! Talk to Binkrit. Right. Save it. Yeah. Wait, how high up was I? Oh. I can't want to see the soup still. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> okay. Oh, it's you. Now they are blinking. Hey, could you help me? I asked the Frank Knight to make that huge mud ball and feed it to me, but then they heard food falling from on the ground. Oh, I left immediately. Can you roll the ball towards me, please? Don't do it, Wum! It might be the last bit of mud Frank Knight needs to explode. Oh, Brinkrit does not feel too well. Maybe Brinkrit ate too much. Why did I do that? Oh god! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Why did you do that? I wanted to eat that! You have to stop eating. No more mud for you. No! I eat mud! I eat all the mud! Oh. Oh. Fuck you, I. Nobody likes me! Oh, he's just fucking dead? I guess we killed him. Oh no! What is happening? Wum and Blink have upset Bankrit. But Blink does not think Bankrit left. The entire world is shaking. Not good. What do we do? Wum and Blink must. Visit Redav Kneed. Redav Kneed knows what to do. Bully! Eh, yeah, fuck you. I guess we can't. I wonder what everyone else is doing outside. Can I even go up here?
Oh, okay. Do you have this stuff to offer to him? Summon him again? I don't think so. Um. Many puzzles. Um, okay, well, we'll be able to summon Raku rapidly. Talking to them a lot inside your inventory, but they don't really go to it now. Maybe I have to close the things. Oh, I know what I'm doing wrong here. I'm just gonna, uh... Yeah, obvious what I did here. That's all spooky. There we go. Don't worry about the Norgates. I think it got this. Greetings again. It's good to see you have brought me more nogurt already. I see no picket bodies. What may I do for you in return? How are you? <laughs> oh, I feel great. Little one. I always feel great. Is there anything else that requires my assistance? See, yeah. they came over to bring me nogurt and asked me how I'm feeling. What a wonderful mind you have, little one. I think very highly of generosity. I suppose I'll return the darkness then. I. Uh, what is one doing? This is a crisis. We need help, Radu. <laughs> what seems to be the issue? The big is sad. Dad, you say. That explains when I saw Banquet crying just a moment ago. The entire world is shaking. Banquet thinks Banquet is causing this. My guess would be the same as yours. The Banquet is making the world crumble. Oh. You see, Banquet has the unique ability to create water from its eyes. Similarly to blisters, they can spit loose water. However, Banquet is capable of creating much more water at the same time, especially when Banquet is, is upset. The amount of water is being that, that is being created by the Banquet right now is tremendous. In fact, 
if it is successfully soaking up all the mud causing it to, to, to slide downwards if we do not intervene a large portion of the world will be shifted downward which will have a catastrophic result the place that the worms called popo city will stag downwards and and eventually be flooded flooded with mud once the mud dries up it is unlikely that any inhabitants can get out safely Similarly, think pol polis or what the worms refer to as the bottom of the sinkhole will be lost. That includes all the Frankners. Oh no. Franker and one made freaking Bankrit cry. It is our fault. Think no. Thinking and Wom had no choice. If Blinkrit kept getting fed by Frankners, Frankrit would have destroyed the world with its puke. Just like that happened to Blinkopolis. Even if Bankrit stops crying, Bankrit can never stop eating mud. Eventually, think it would overeat and destroy the world with its mud puke. Therefore, I must take Bankrit with me. I have been planning this for a while. Wum and Blinkin, thus the world may have no food for a creature like bank Bankrit's. But my own new world can make very good use of Bankrit. The more the Bankrit pukes, the bigger my new world will get. I cannot take the bank with me by myself. As you may have noticed, Wom, I cannot be exposed to sunlight. The location of bank is dark, but not out of the sun's reach. Therefore, I will need you to darken the area where bank is located. Can't you touch sunlight? Oh, little Wub is a long and complex story. I am willing to tell you, but it will require a lot of time. A lot of time. You may not have at this moment. Tell me everything. I admire your curiosity, but keep an eye on the time. I hope you'll make you understand the inner workings of our bodies and forms. I can teach you about Funus, Plump, Nurgit, Gittikatorm, and Forngit. What would you like to me to talk about? Funist. Funus is one of the three types of particles present in each and every creature. I like to describe Funus as the energy source inside a living creature. When a creature dies, the Funus gets knocked out of his body. Then, as the Funus is exposed to sunlight, it will disappear to a place I call Cantatorum. Cantatorum. Cantatorum is both the origin and destination of life as we know it. It is hard to explain what it is exactly, but it is tremendously large and contains an incredible amount of energy. It is where new creatures are designed and information about past lives is stored. Yes, new life. New variations of Plump get sent to this world, tangled with Funus when both connect the, with the Nurgit in this world, a creature is formed. Once Funus departs from the body, it takes a copy of its creature Plump back to Cantorium. With that, Cantorium it can access all the information about the creature. How light was, was it life? What did it learn? How did it die? Incredible. Indeed, Blink is its goal. Goal? Hard to tell, but according to my own theory, Cantorium is, curi is curiosity trying to invent the perfect creature. A creature that can inhabit worlds, survive its obstacles, but all while keeping the world intact. Once the fitness and the plump arrive at Cantorium, it is time to make tweaks and send a new prototype. According to my theory, yes. You, me, the Blinkin, we are all prototypes for the perfect creature, but, it, but I do not think the perfect creature will ever be formed, as I may, may have com compiled the process of, of, for a Katorium. Did it, What did you do? Katorium method has been working flawlessly until I inv invent, intervene in the cycle. For the Blinkin, there was only ever one creature alive at a time. Every time the creature had a unique trait which was being tested by Katorium. According to my theory, I was spawned in this world with an endless desire for information and knowledge. I studied my own body and so I learned about Funus, Plump, and Nurgit. But as I grew more knowledgeable, I also became obsessed with sharing that information. I was starting to feel a real sense of purpose and control, but I knew that I could not act by myself alone. Information would have to surpass my lifespan. I had to invent multiple multiplication to maximize the longevity of discovered information. Did you? I did. Well, I don't know how to turn Durgit into Funist. 
but I got reckless in doing so, and it cost me my life. Place all my bodily nerve got exposed to sunlight, and thus I was launched back to Cretorium. I did not clone myself. It was only after my death that I learned how to spread plump onto different objects. It turned out to be simple, just touch the world around you. I, however, was obsessed with surviving as long as I could, so I could maximize my chances of fulfilling a purpose. I determined that it would be safest to never touch anything. I would not get squashed by a rolling rock, I would not get stuck in the ground, I would simply float around for an eternity. Once I returned to the world in phone nougat form, I managed to clone a blink. Blink used to trade Nurgit for a new Blinket friends. Rebdev Kane made Blinket life incredible. Suddenly, there were large numbers of Blinket. As Blinket lost their lives, Kratorium suddenly re re received copies of creatures with high finger save. It never accord accounted for creatures to multiply un un auton un un autonomously. Unaware of the new phenomenon, it created a, a, a banquet while the world was still inhabited by Blinket. I don't think Katorium ever managed to adapt to the broken cycle, which is why more and more species are appearing. It is under the impression that new plump designs only survive for minutes, and therefore has lost all sense of direction. Katorium is, a, is in a chaotic state, which results in Unus not being able to return and instead floating around aim, and aimlessly. More and more species are being formed, even without my help, helping hand. This is long. I do, sometimes. I could probably turn your favorite rock into a living one, but especially nowadays, there's foolness and lost lives roaming around in between this world and Katorium. It, if it is dark enough, light can appear by itself without me, no, without, without me, without Katorium. This is impressive. Um, how are is the blanket holding up? The blanket doesn't quite understand any longer. Too complicated. One must not forget one and blanket have world to save. I said it's time to focus on the blinker situation. What do you think? Um, what would you like to be taught about? Plump. Plump is a smart particle that can behold wisdom and memories. Each creature requires Plump to maintain consciousness. Once a new variation of Plump is designed, it will perfect to define certain qualities and characteristics in a creature. These characteristics can then be developed further through a creature's experiences. Physical, physically, Plump is sticky and nests itself within Nogurt. While feeding on a Nogurt, it is able to multiply itself, enabling creatures to become wiser indefinitely. Huh. Chromium is both the origin and destination of life as we know it. It is hard to explain why it is, what it is exactly, but it is tremendously large and contains an incredible amount of energy. It is where new creatures are designed and information about the past lives is stored. Yes, new life. New variations of Plump get sent to this world tangled with Funus, which both connect to the Nugget and the world of the creatures form. Once Funus departs from the body, it takes a copy of the creatures Plump back into the Cretorium. With that, Cretorium can access all the information about the creature. How was its life? Okay. Then. Nogurt and bone gurt. Everything in this world is made out of nogurt, plants, stones, but also living creatures. Nogurt is what shields Furnace from sunlight and it serves as a nutrition for Plump to multiply. Nogurt is bound to its world, this world, and unlike Plump and Furnace, it cannot travel to Cretorium. Huh. Perhaps my most exciting invention is what I call Fun Gurt State. Traditionally, Plump needs Nogurt to nest and multiply, but I figured out a new quality in Funus. Funus must travel through an entire creature, its body, through an entire creature, its body, what? And therefore, changes shape constantly. Now I learned how to bend Funus in any de destiny, de density, any shape, or any structure. I transform from large quantities of Funus in such a way that it, ma it, it mimics Nogurt and therefore it tricks Plump to nest and reproduce inside it. Now, you, Wum, and Binka are in a traditional Nurgit state, and I read up kind kind of, am in Forgert state. I can only be exposed to sunlight for six seconds, but unlike you, I can leave and enter this world freely. But perhaps you will experience what is what it is like to be in the Forgert state soon.
I already did this though, right? Alright, why don't you guys run through the, the chain of dialogue then? Bankrate is currently in a place I call the flip side. It is on the same location where you last saw Bankrate, only behind the mud wall. How do Bankrate and the woman get there? I made it easy for you, Wom. Does Bankrate remember the warp mask that Blink has crafted many years ago? Yes, Blink still carries warp packs around everywhere. Wonderful. Please give the warp packs to the Wom. Okay. What mask is. Transportation device that will take you to the station I call Tucson. If you wear the work mask, something that Wums are very familiar with, you will be taken to Tucson the moment you the moment you die. What? It does not sound pleasant, but I assure you it is not half as bad as it sounds. In fact, I made it quite easy to use as you can press and hold left mouse button. From the Tushin station, you can warp to several locations in this world, including Bankrate's location. Once your body reconnects with this world, your original form will be restored. The worm use warp mask to teleport to Tushin and then find a way to Bankrate? Precisely. Shall we meet in Tushin? Discuss that in Tushin. I will see you there. Okay, so one goes into what mask and whoop to two sin by dying or holding the left mouse button. Huh. Well, Uh, you made it. Log into Tucson dimension. It is not much, but it does have a very a nice view. Behind me, you can see a statue made of these different objects I connected with your world. All of these figures have a connection to a certain area there. If you jump into the corresponding bubble in front of them, you will be sent to that location. If you change your mind, you can go you can witness to break the bubble. Oh, and before I forget, this, this might feel strange, but since there is no Nurga in this place, you are just like me, which means you can fly. <gasps> However, I strongly recommend that you stay close to this platform. Whatever direction you go in from here will lead to nothing but emptiness. You don't want to get lost there. Well, to get to break rent, you must figure the upper... You must... The upper figure of the statue, that one is connected to the flip side of your world. Do you remember what to do once you're there? Yes. Good luck. I'm gonna explore. this thing this is nothing Meaning of life, you say, well, well, there is no answer to that question, but I think there is a reason for that. I like to think that the answer has con 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 consciously been left open, because it's yours to fill in.
How do I say the world again? I forgot. I want to take the brick with me in a new world going built. Now, as you know, probably know, I cannot travel through sunlight, so in order for me to enter the room, I would take Brennan with me. It would be a pitch black. Just to make it the whole room dark. Do you, whatever it is to make that happen. Got it. Okay. Um. Okay, wrong place. Um, <laughs> that's rough. Um, this one. Where will this lead me? Really now? Huh. I wanna pay my bitch to Carlos, at least. Could have been inside the elevator. Hey, it's been a while. Hope that you have a good time. How is it in Popo City? Awesome. Oh, okay, good. I'm glad. So what's up now? I want to live here again. I haven't prepared for this. Do you think that changed enough to be almost not to spill ice cream anymore? Not really. I have changed. Oh, okay, then I guess you can live here again. The way asked for the room I gave you last time you were here, so you can stay there. Either way, I'm not serving you ice cream anymore. In fact, I'm not serving anyone anything anymore. Well, except for Freddy. He really needs a food, but he can clean up him after himself. So, I'll come back then, huh? Huh. Hmm, I think I'm going to Pobo City myself now. Well, that wasn't so bad, was, was it? Alright. Uh, check this out. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa, wow, what just happened? You, you need to teach me how to make an entrance like that. Only the best can pull that off. What are you talking about? What? I mean, you just appeared inside the crystal ball! Am I going crazy? The jump makes me crazy! Ah! Alright, well... That's a crystal ball. David. Okay, so now these symbols are making a lot more sense now. Okay, this one, where does this one take me? This is where I need to go. This seems where I need to go. 
Wow, Scallywag. You've done many things, but what we're about to do it might decide the fate of the world. You feel that? Squaw! Hee hee, I think that feeling is called responsibility. But hey, after all we've been through, I just know that you're going to do great. I believe in you, Scallywag. Wah! Save the world. I guess I'll finish the game. Credits? What's that? Wah! I've got to say, I feel really. I really feel these cries, Scallywag. It really sounds like the Brickrent has no idea what what's he's doing to the world. Kind of sad. Yeah, and I don't think Red Dog can it. And him are exactly best friends. Oh, where can Ken... Redav Keen knows what he's doing? It would be fine. Me too. I guess we're kind of scambling with the bankrupt future here, but there's no other option. If bankrupt stays, he, this world will be destroyed. So let's get if it, everything we got, Scallywag. No matter how hard the bankrupt might struggle, we will prepare the room for Ribdicative's entrance. Save the world. Yeah, I don't even know how to pronounce half these words, okay? Alright, here we go. Wah! This seems to be the end of the of his scallywag. You don't really know what to expect. I hope you're prepared. I'm always prepared. I'm never prepared. I know that. Okay, I guess up there. Well, what's this way then? I play League and like. I want to done with this game probably. Can be soon. Huh. Huh? or protects you from any projectiles for 10 seconds. No cooldown. Ah! What if I fucking kill you, huh? Oh. Well, thanks. I try to kill him. <laughs> he just disappears. So like the the, the ghost, that like, that's the ghost, right? And the light, like if, if you make the light bright, it fucking kills him. But he just ran away. This is my coffee hat. It gives me life as I drink it. Dude, the PvP. This is actually pretty nuts. This is it, one. There is. There are some gaps in the mud walls that are light, letting light through. But one should not worry about darkening the room. Blinkit will take care of that. One should focus on distracting the Blinkit, the, the Blinkit, so Blinkin can fill the gas with mud and darken the room. Good idea. Really? I don't believe you. Good. Blinkit, believe in one. Ah! Hey there, the one that stopped, told me to stop eating mud. What are you doing here? Oh yeah, well... Hmm. What did I do underwater then, huh? What are you doing here? The world is collapsing. What? What does that have to do with me? Here's what make the entire world sink. Pinkrit doesn't like you anymore. Leave me alone. I did a swim. Ugh. How do I use this? Oh my god. Oh, I died. 
It's just like Dark Souls, man. Oh my god, that instant kills me. I'm not pausing! Well, I don't have a choice. It has to be that way. I think I just need to stay alive, really. New game plan, stay alive. Oh no. Oh my god. He's gonna fucking ram his chin at me. What if I'm right in here? Okay, it doesn't matter if I'm in the fucking crevices. I don't I don't know, it's like paint or some shit. Oh, this is bullshit. No. Whoa, 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 whoa. What's this? Hey, this guy is an issue, okay? He's, gonna, he's killing the whole world. I gotta save it. It's up to people like me, not like people like you. Ah! <laughs> oh my god, that scared me. What the fuck? I did 80 damage. <sighs> uh. What if I don't even try to kill him? Let's try to stay alive. Oh god. Okay. Sometimes it's too hard to dodge. Like I can't, I can't dodge that one. If I just stay over here, no, it does. It does nothing.
I'm trying to hack, okay? Because it's hard. Ah. Okay, I think I figured out a way to fight that one off now. That's the hardest one to fight. I think if I run into him? No. What? Okay, thought I figured that one out, but I didn't. I, I don't think I, I'm supposed to kill him. I'm supposed to just wait. Because we need to take him back to the to the to the, the other guy's dimension so that he just takes him away. And we gotta make it dark dark so he could come in here and do his thing. I could heal up passively with this. Okay, I figured, okay, I'm getting better at this now. This is the best one. This is the, the best phase. Oh no. At the KO! Okay. Alright, he's gonna shoot his shit now.
Oh my god, thank god that <laughs> invincibility was still going. God damn. And then we spike here, and then we run this way. Then we come back over here. Oh my god, he's shooting like... Smaller ones. Oh, what's going on now? What the fuck? This is going to be too much. Dude, this is tilting me. I think if I stay close <laughs> to him, he elongates it, like it continues his form longer. If I stay close to him, I'm pretty sure. What's he doing now? Oh. Oh, this one? Oh god. I think he's gonna shoot his shit now. That's such a hard one to dodge, man. Oh no, that's where I die. Go under him! Oh, I fucking used that when I didn't want to. God damn it.
Oh god. I got cornered. I didn't see him. I didn't think he was gonna move that way like that. Oh, okay, I think I can slow it down and not be attacked by that. Uh Alright, see you next year, man. Okay, I'm figuring this out now. The hardest one for me, I figured that one out, so... <laughs> That's just so hard. Oh, every time it seems like it's impossible to do. My, oh, okay. Oh, I can't do that anymore, huh?
fuck! I didn't know what he was gonna do. Oh, it's a bug now? Oh, yeah, it's fixed, whatever. Hold on, let me get my. This is one. Ooh, that was close. All right, here we go. Can I just react dodge it? Oh my god, that's so hard to do. I was wrong, I was wrong, I was wrong. Okay. Oh, I hate that move so fucking much. Okay. I love this move now. This was my, my one I hated the most, now I love it. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. No, come on, mouse, move! My, my keyboard gets fucked up sometimes with arrows. Okay, uh, food? Ah. Okay, I'm ready for this one. Oh, not this time, bud.
Did we do it? Oh no, please. Die? Oh! Oh! Greetings, Binkrentz. Rev Dev King. Rev Givnid. What are you doing here? You and I are going to build a new world together. What? What do you mean? I'm going to take you to another dimension. But I like it here. No. I want to stay! I'm afraid you have no choice, Bankeritz. But you will be happy, I'm sure of it. Happy? Then what are you doing to me? I don't like this feeling! See you soon, Bankeritz. Okay, bye! Whoa. Bravo, one. You have saved this world and enabled the creation of a new one. I have to go now, as you may understand. There is a lot of explaining to do to Bankerit. Farewell, Wum. May the future bring our world together in peace. Holy fuck. Well, did you see that? Wah! can't believe you pulled out that one off of him. Do you think Bakerit will be alright? I think it will be fine. Holy fuck, we did it, we beat it. This need, this needs some time. Oh man. Game. We beat it on the hardest difficulty. Feels great. Popo City incorporated the sinkhole into their city, naming it New Popylon. It took a while before the Frankenisters and the Wombs got used to each other. Ultimately, the Wombs managed to win respect from the Frankenisters mainly due to their incredible skills in Frank Ball. The two Bakelins started restoring Redev's Kanid's guest house. Oh. They also prepared giant mud cakes whenever Redev and the Bakelin came over. It is cute. <laughs> Uber, uh, Uber Hank and Beavis has steadily migrated to Kniff away from the Popo City. Oh, the, yeah, Kniff away from the Popo City. Yep. They are now working hard to, try to teach them to how to speak. <laughs> Travis T Tavis was happy to, ex to expand his gang with a large group of Frankensters. Oh. The Franksters were happy to continue their savage lifestyle under his leadership. Alice Water, Alice Dinker, and Alice Frinker joined to found the world's first university. Oh. A place where every creature is welcome to study. Most of the students are currently bl balonies. Oh, so far people. The last of the blisters turned the islands into boats and sailed for the horizon. Just turned a whole island into a fucking boat? Many worms and spike hikers live to like to believe that blisters found the true meaning of life. Huh. The spikers are currently investigating water rights now that there's so much an uninhabited space in the sea. Huh. They plan to launch their first ride in a couple of years. The Belayans built a new kingdom underground, and a cave where once a great rock reside. A 
After the last spit hiker discovered the cave, it became their new king. Huh. After a few more years of hard work, Carlo finally retired from the womb house. He is currently residing in one of the new VIP rooms in Subtle Pop Popo City. Oh. Rom has replaced Carlo as the new manager of the Wilm House. Residents are still getting used to this district policy concerning morning exercise. Light lift Wilm is on sabbatical in Winterspeak. Huh? Here is already looking. Looking forward to returning to his new old job in the Wilm House. Oh, I never checked out Wonder Splake. Uh, fuck. The Crow's brilliant story is out of, is out of business. <sighs> Rev Kinney built a house in Tucson Dimension for a brave Wilm that will once save the world. Me. New Game Plus. Huh. That game was so fucking cool. It was so sick. I enjoyed it a lot. It was awesome. So fun. It was so cute. And uh, all the timings and places you had to be and go and do. Shame I didn't get to explore um, the, the Wonder Splick and the Wisest One. I didn't get to go see those two guys. But hopefully the game continues outdoors. It seems like it would. A little bit more. It was neat having the face be like uh like the, the boss be a face right because it's like, like you could look at his face and you could telegraph his uh, his next moves because his face and like it's just it's natural for people to interpret faces so it's easy to tell what he's going to do next once you pay attention to his face and interpret what he's going to do that's pretty neat i like that opal bread i'm hungry i don't know what i'm gonna eat like rewarding myself for a job well done. Make it like a Jack and Box combo. Yeah, no, this game was really, really cool. I recommend this. I'll probably recommend this to like everyone. So cute and easy to play and and challenging and rewarding. And there's like, yeah, you, you get better at the game and then how the game works and bosses and stuff. I feel like I did like 80% of the game. There's like another 20% I didn't do. Okay. So, uh, it's just. Man. It's so cool. It's so cool. It's such a cool game. I wish there was a lot more of it. I wish it was like five times bigger and the world was bigger and you could just go through all these areas and do all these things. And it wasn't even Castlevania and you could pretty much do the whole game with just without even upgrading anything or changing your loadout. And the writing is really cool. I just wish the dialogue trees were a bit better. The dialogue trees are pretty, pretty uh, hit or miss. 
probably one of the major grapes. One of the only things that the game didn't do right as the entire luck trees. The kind of player that I am, like I get overwhelmed when I have too many options. Especially like too many options to explore. But it, the game did a good job of like making it so like no matter what how you go about it, you're gonna get to every part of the game, you're gonna see everything, you're gonna go everywhere. And I, and I guess like kinda like in a in a story con in a story way to look at it, I get to take a vacation and go to Splinter Splink and see what all the hubbub's about, right? See what all the fun is, the music park the vacation. Wee. Why Peppo happy? Peppo white happy. What the hi? What the YouTuber? Hey, that's me. <laughs> wow. Wow. Oh, that's so bright. Ah, greetings. Oh yes, the house. I had a hunch, hunch, or was it a dream? I thought you'd like it if I built you a house here. Love it. <laughs> I dreamt about this game. Ah, uh, interesting. But back on topic. The pancreas is on the flip side of the world. I believe in you, one. Who's that thing? Is that the world we live in? Oh, I get by all the store artifacts. See what they do? Yes. A couple things that I want to do in this game. Alright, so when I get, I guess next time we'll just do that then. Do a little extracurricular activities and then we'll call it. Sounds nice. Alright, uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Thank you for being part of it. Uh, the ending. It was really, really cool. Makes me feel really warm. Was he was the inside? I'll just let the song play me out. <laughs> 